Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time in the Snow Kingdom, hung out with the Shaverians, crashed the whatever Grand Prix, forget what it's called, something Boulder, I don't know. And today we're going to the Luncheon Kingdom. So I hope you brought your appetites. Let's get the heck out of here. It's a little bit too chilly, Willie. We're gonna get our grub on. How about that? I feel like getting our hour. If you like getting your grub on, consider liking the video, commenting, subscribing, etc. Ooh. Time to have a nice hot meal, perhaps. Frost, frosted cake. Oh, good one, Cappy. Nice. Nailed it. Review some useful skills. No, that's not useful skills. If you don't know how to long jump by now, after 8 million Marios, I don't know what to tell you. Let's read up on the Luncheon Kingdom. It says here this country is famous for using a volcano to prepare a dish called Stupendous Stew. Okay. It's got all the makings for a delicious delicacy. Find out what this is all about here in a moment. Ooh, it's very pink. There's a lot of goo here. Oh boy. Is that a giant taco up there? Put the meat in the taco? The Brutals are after some cooking. Just cannot stop running into these guys. All right, so, uh, my goodness. The Brutals. Wow, thanks, Cappy. Good eye. Probably not the best thing to be wearing. It is a little, a little spicy here. Looks like we need to get 18 moons to advance. Let's go ahead and... I usually do this before off camera, but I forgot. Let's go ahead and get back into our normal threads here. The Mario suit. I don't know why it's called that. It's just his clothes. All right. His uniform, perhaps. Let's go ahead and take a look. First try. Here we go. Luncheon Kingdom. The popular destination for the hungry. Mount Volbono. Okay. The bubbling berg that heats the meats. Viewers, what heats your meats? Population is plentiful. The size is buffet. Buffets are disgusting. The locals are called vo, vo, Volbonit. Okay. The currency is tomato shaped. Food, minerals, the industry, and it's a pretty spicy place to go. So here you go. Uh, here's a little bit of reading if you want to do. The cheese is hard as a rock. The cheese, Mount Volbono, is quite hard. Likely because it is left near the lava and dries out completely. I don't care. All right, so next, the cooking carnival. A resting place for meat. Watch where you rest your meat, viewers. And the Piranza Plaza. Three keys to this kingdom. Sample the famous dish, stupendous stew. It's what the locals eat. It's what kids crave. Gape at exotic ingredients. Gape. Like gigantic vegetables and rock-hard cheeses. Are you rock-hard with your cheese? You're Marvel at the preserved architecture, the best kept secret, and tours. Is it though? All right, anyway. So this is an interesting kingdom. It's very different. Uh, obviously food themed. You couldn't already figure it out. There are Goombas with chef hats, which is, uh, how do we say, mwah, chef's kiss. Very cute. Whoa, almost fell in the goo. There's these tomato boys. Ooh, that doesn't look good. We can, uh, corn on the cob here. Oh, no. Oh, okay, that's like straight fire. Ooh, Goombat wants to, what, wants the Goombas to corn her cob. All right, let's see if we can make that happen for her. I don't know if there's a real good way. How do we get over there? This doesn't seem like this is going to go well for me. But why would it? Okay, um, can you make this jump? Yes. Okay, wonderful. And how about one more? All right. Uh, we can't jump very far. So, can we make this? Absolutely not. Okay, well, you know, we'll come back to that when we figure out how to do it. I do believe we can capture these things though. 
Oh, he's got a big old nose. Look at him. I forget what these are called. Called goobers, maybe. Uh, viewers? What do you think? Uh-oh. It's the Brutos. Oh, I used the Brutos. This is a fight right here. Was not expecting to do this. Ha ha. Stole a whole boatload. I don't know if a boatload is an actual measurement, but I've heard a buttload is, so. Oh, we are fighting, okay. Oh, this guy. Burr, burr. He sounds very intelligent. Don't judge a rabbit by its burr, burr. Okay. So what are these things on the ground? Are these jelly beans? Some sort of bean? He doesn't quite have the same sort of battle arena geometry here to benefit himself. Ooh, he's, he's, he's spewing his goo in at me. Oh, there's a heart over here, right? Nice. Very nice. Chef's kiss. I cannot see where he's going because I am not paying attention. Ooh, no, we're safe. You hit him when he's in, in mid goo. You don't want to mess with somebody from their mid goo, I'll tell you that. Oof. All right. I think we're just about done with the fight, though. He doesn't have his hat, so that should do it. I like his cravat. His necktie. That should net us a multi... Nope, just a regular moon. Lame. Normally, it's a multi-moon. Mario's covering you right now. Let's get rid of that. I've got a feeling that this might be one of those... Not just one episode to get all the necessary moons episodes. Cause I need 18 under the cheese rocks. Make sure you clean under your cheese rocks, viewers. Yes, cause I don't know, ooh, thank you. I feel like 18 is a quite a lofty goal, especially cause it took me seven minutes to get one. Not my best work. What do these do? Nothing. Hooray! All right, now we get to see one of the goofiest captures. We can become a fork. What the fork? Talk to me, boy. Look at his tie. Oh. Kings and things are kind of on fire. No kidding. Looks like you could use some help. Pick me. That bird up there took over the stew pot. What a jerk. Oh, how could you? I took over the stew. Listen to this music, though. What's that darn bird doing up there? Good question. Can I help you? Climbing the mountain used to be a piece of cake. Sprout wings or hitch a ride with a flappy type. Flappy bird? I remember there being something about how, like, if you... We're able to get rid of all these cans. I think that you can get a, uh, a star of some sort. Turnips. Okay, so he wants a little bit of help gathering ingredients. Takatu's over here. Hello. You know it. Swimming in magma. Got a feeling it might have to do with those gooey boys that we saw before. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see. Okay. This is kind of like a, um, looks like maybe a throwback to Mario 2. Um, don't you mean Donkey Donkey Penny? All right. Ooh, golden boy. Can't imagine something being gold making it better. Like, people want to eat steak covered in gold leaf. That just sounds disgusting to me. There is a certain level of decadence when it comes to aesthetics that I will pass because I think that it sucks. Anyway, all right. So we still need quite a bit of coinage before we can crazy cap it. Let's see what's back here. Just a moon hiding in the crates. What's oh, up there though? But, okay, um, there's more tomatoes. How do you feel about tomatoes, viewers? Do you like tomatoes? I will eat um, 
I will eat cooked tomatoes in like a sauce, like a tomato sauce or tomato, if you say things wrong. Um, I like a good salsa, perhaps, but like raw tomatoes, mm, absolutely not. There's just so many people that are begging for my help right now. I need you to back off. I'm trying to do stuff. See that slab of meat? Viewers, I'm right here. They're gonna make off with your meat. They're gonna beat your meat. All right, so we got we got the goober. Are there other? Ooh. Yes. Let's get all these coins we can get here. I feeling. I feeling. I have a feeling. The Luncheon Kingdom's gonna be a good night. Um. No, I have a feeling that we're gonna need probably somewhere in the ballpark of like 15 to 20. I think that's usually the amount that you need to buy the outfit. Salt. Oops. Okay. Well, that was stupid. Um, is there a boy we can borrow? Yes. There's a bonus right here. Can we jump up to this? Heck yeah. We Oops. That's not solid. You probably have to let go once you're Mario. Oops. But we did save our place here. We have a reservation. With pain. All right. Oh, viewers, it's going to be one of those days. I do love Mario being one of these things. Let's look at this real quick. Oh, viewers, please indulge. Indulge in the Mario. I love it. It's very cute. I'm not trying to make a thumbnail. No, viewers, stop assuming. It's very cute. And it just might be. Actually, it's pretty good. You just go to pause for a second. All right. All right, now, there we go. Now we figured it out. Now we're cooking with gas. Oh yeah, this song. This is the, um, the Bounding Bowl Grand Prix whatever song. Is that what it's called? I could not figure it out. Okay, more coinage, love that. Ooh, I don't know, oh, okay. That's probably not where I need to go. <laughs> yeah, just launch myself into the abyss. I'm not feeling super confident that I'm going to be able to get all the moons in this one. It seems like there's a lot to do and not as much time as I would have preferred. So this might be a you get some of them kind of thing and then you, you take what you get and you don't throw a fit, viewers. Okay. Is this important? Okay. I don't really like this gimmick here. At least the way this is set up. This is a little bit uh, diabolical. Okay. That's a long way down. And you gotta redo it every time. Oh, viewers, we're having the time of our lives. Okay. Patience, D-Mike, we can make it. Good things come to those who wait. Also, good things come to those who don't, so, you know, it's a time and a place that you just gotta be there. Nope. Let's not clip our audio. All right. And yeah, I keep forgetting that it's not just about flicking yourself off. It's about giving yourself the time and space to throw your cap because you need to latch onto one of these Okay, how do I get over there? That's the real question. Fork flick into the summit. Uh, can I just long jump maybe? Oh yeah. That's what Cappy taught us today. I'm amazing. That's two stars in like five seconds. That's a fork flick and detour. It's kind of inappropriate to say, but. Oh, oof. no. <laughs> I did it again. I don't think this matters though, because we can just leave. As far as I know, with our 227 lives, we can vamoose and see if we can grab another goober. I think they jump up just to the level of the great. That would be great. 
The last time I made a great pun, I had a video hit five figures. So viewers, if you want to make that happen, that'd be awesome. I don't know how algorithms work. All right, so there is a little more here. More tomatoes. I have 20 coins. I feel like that's probably enough. But I'm just going to shimmy shimmy over here. Shimmy shimmy Cocoa Puff. Oh, um, oh Mario. Oh, that's so cute. I don't know which one I'm going to use now. Oh no, my thumbnail is conflicting. Looks like there's a little goober path here. And just to be safe. You know what, Cappy? How about you back off? I'm exploring. It's called an adventure. It's my odyssey, not yours. You are in my indentured servant. All right. Okay, so you can't jump on those. That's fine. Oh, okay. So Mario just gave you a giant concussion. Is this going to be a problem? No. All right. So we've clearly already done this. This is the area, the staging spot right before we make it to the... Everybody wants to complain to me, factory. Oh, there's the, the bird and the, and the meat and the me, 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 me. Everybody's just wine, 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 wine. Figure it out, all right? So we need to buy the requisite free star. I mean, it's not free. It's a hundred coinos. I call it the freebie though. Shopping in Mount Valbona. For some hot styles. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I'm, I'm almost bummed that it's uh, that it's not the, the beret. I like that, too. I feel like that's probably a throwback to... Um, probably a throwback to Mario Paint. He does look like he's wearing a smock. Smug smock. All right, let us in. Um, you're looking at one. So if that's all it takes is just to dress the part, you know, it's not dressed to impress. It's dressed to fool people into doing occupations you don't. Okay. Uh, I feel like I need to get one of these boys. A little hotter. Okay. Can we jump into it? With one of these boys? I think we can. Boo. Really? That's it? Okay. I mean, I'm not... I'm not getting a ton of stars. That's mean. <laughs> I'm not getting... Not stars. I'm not getting any stars, actually. Uh, I'm not getting a ton of moons in this episode. But I am getting them quickly, so... Maybe we'll be able to pull off like half season. We still have about 10-ish minutes, so. There's still a chance, viewers. Why don't you believe me? All right, so we have these very grumpy tomatoes. That's me after I eat one on accident. I'm like, oh, did I see the tomato? I hate this. I can't believe I just ate a gosh dang tomato. Ooh. Oops. This is not going to go well. I like burnt Mario, though. Was there a goober behind that I could have latched onto? Or, or, oh, I see what it is. These guys are they're little temporary platforms. I see. When you when you land on them, they provide you some solace. Yes. A nice tomato sauce. You don't have to get too far, I don't think. Now come in here and let me land on you. I will use you for murder. All right, so exactly what Mario sounds like. All right, so now we're in the goo. Yeah. We can... Really? That's... Okay. It feels a little inexact that this is how these moons are being gathered. I'm not complaining. It's an extreme simmer. Simmer down. Head it out? Yeah, I'm getting the heck out of here. Why not? Okay. So... The one thing was complaining. Did I do whatever you needed me to do? It's 
Sprout wings are headed to flank. So... I definitely need to get up there somehow. Uh, more tomatoes back there. Ooh. Can you believe it, viewers? I don't know. Is there like a, a glot? Ooh. All right, so it looks like I got to bring it around town. It looks like I got to get over there somehow. Up to the top using the... What's that darn bird doing up there? Not existing, that's what it's doing. Look at these cute little birds. These cute little boys. All right. Let's uh, go with these big goof hounds. So this looks promising. This, like, this kind of looks like Pepto-Bismol, which would be appropriate, you know, in a place that involves food. I've never, I've never personally used Pepto-Bismol, but I probably would be one of their target demographics. My body hates pretty much everything I eat. Viewers, my suggestion, uh, don't have that condition. Just don't do that. Problem solved. Okay. So it looks like we are headed to the hard cheese rock area, whatever. Hello? Can I help you? Stupendous stew. Oh, no. It's covered in salt. Just like people when they watch my stuff. So salty. Oh, yeah. Check this out. Out of the frying pan and into the frying pan. Okay. So, what is this? Oh, you're just respawning. Okay, I got excited for a second. Can I... Is that a... That might be a story moon. I'm almost guaranteeing that it is. Ooh, there's tomatoes in here. There's tomatoes in my cheese. Cheesy tomatoes. What is this? SpaghettiOs? All right. Woo! All right. This guy's excited. This looks like this has like a, a moon marker under it. Who knows it's a speech? Nintendo Switch. We'll need Mario for that in a moment to make sure there's nothing else. No surprises. All right. Does this create a bridge platform of some sort, or do my am I gonna need to get another boy? I might. Need another boy. Okay. I mean, we're not doing poorly in terms of moons per minute especially when we find a moon under our cheesy rocks is this going to create some pathway for me oh yeah okay big pot dive in if we hurry maybe we can beat this bird beat our meat all right so it looks like Obviously, we have to be careful here because we cannot be these boys on solid land. So we will need help from our tomato friends who are so saucy. Okay, so it looks like we can jump to the grate. I don't know if that's not really a way. I don't know how long I need this. If at all, Ooh, there's a bonus here. Another bonus. Another one. I'm getting so distracted, I'm not gonna be able to finish this in time. I wish this bonus music was a little bit more fun. Like, the bounding bowl music, I enjoyed that. That was good for me. Ooh. Ooh. I am shocked that that counted. All right, so this looks precarious. This is very skinny goo. grab these tomatoes. I mean, there's no real reason for me to do this. Like I already mentioned before, I have no real enthusiasm for completing this game in its entirety. I'm just completing enough of it that you see it. All right, there's got to be another, another boy. Oh, there's one up there. Is there a way back? Do I have to kill myself? I'm going to have to kill myself. Wee! Strategic suicide. All right. Those two words don't belong together. All right. So it was... It was this way. 
And then this way... Oops, not that way. Yeah, I'm thinking... I'm thinking we'll deal with that bird brain <laughs> next time. I want to focus on just getting as many of these moons as I can. I mean, usually my quota for moons was like 10. So viewers, technically... That was horrible. Technically, I have not underwhelmed. I did not... I did not underperform. I may have overpromised though. You want to underpromise and overperform, viewers. That's the way to climb the corporate ladder. Because that's what life's all about. Is uh, oops, is pleasing your corporate overlords. All right. Don't we all just want to become the CEO of company X Y Z? All right. So I think this is where that moon. Ooh, viewers. Nice. Crossing to the magma. It's gonna be my next hardcore metal album. Hello, we're Corpse Rocket, and this is Crossing to the Magma. All right, time for a quick reset. Is that ten moons? One, two. Uh, okay. Not a time to count. But I can grab these tomatoes. This is pointless. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, viewers, I have eleven moons. Usually I get 10, so like, I'm not trying to be that guy, but like maybe back off. And just All right, is this a moon? This feels kind of moony, or just coins. Pointless, all right. I mean, I actually did die quite a few times in there, so maybe it's not so bad to, to refuel the tank. But we cannot do any damage to spinies. This is a very good, um, I feel like this is, is this gonna trigger that fight? I don't know. What is this? Twitch? Oh, viewers were meat. <laughs> uh, I would put this as the thumbnail, but I don't feel like people would understand it. All right, viewers, well, you know what? I I'm going to let this be the end of today's episode, and I will meet you next time for that boss fight. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey, and I'll see you next time. Bye.